so good morning everyone let's start today's session uh, first of all today um, we will discuss about the next assignment okay already we are done with the assignment one and uh, already last day we are seeing the group by uh, not group by that uh, the aggregation function the code aggregation function and the sql null values okay so today we will discuss about the SQL assignment two. So I'm not wasting any more time, just giving you the assignment. Uh, first of all, let's table creation. Okay. Uh, Sefali, Gayatri, Mehul, am I audible? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. And uh, Boma Prasant, today is your first day, right? Hello. Hello. I'm not audible, uh, Brahma Prasant, uh, to you. I don't know what is happening, but uh, see, the last day you are not joining, and already uh, we discussed about the last class about the aggregation function. And uh, as I told in the fumble, that there is a miscommunication that already classes are going on in WhatsApp link, they are provided, but not my fumble. But I am already providing all the details, all the um, playlist in the Pumble group. Please go through it because SQL is very much easy. Uh, and from the next week, your Python class will be resumed because the trainer will be some busy in some exams and work. So that's why it is some pause. Uh, but I hope you will cover up. Uh, first of all, you please go through the playlist and already joining the classes regular basis three days in a week uh, but remember one thing try to cover up and if any fault or any issue you have been faced there will be revision class for sql okay so the thing is today we will discuss about the sql assignment too uh, boma let me know in the chat box that you already know the sql You already know SQL or not? Please write down in the chat box. Little bit, not so much. Okay. <clears throat> so, light uh, data analyst SQL is a uh, MySQL is a database. Okay. MySQL database where we are actually resolve our query. Uh, there is a database provided just like CSV files in Excel. Database provided in a tabular form. Uh, that way, we have to solve some query. We have to solve uh, some performance. Um, more over times, we have not to create database or not to, sorry, not to create table. But for the assignment purpose, we have to create table because uh, when the client project in the, in the other company, in very big company, their database already uh, present in their server. But for the assignment purpose, we have to create the database. So, the thing is, make a heading in your notebook. Assignment to MySQL. And uh, the next thing is, first of all, I will uh, showcase you, already showcase for the last class, last uh, assignment, uh, what table you have to create or how to create the table. And the query, all the query, you have to um solve by yourself but first of all i am giving you we just see in the second assignment i think okay just checking yes 23 queries are there in the second assignment and so on is going on okay so first of all i showcase you what table we have to create so like Three tables we have to create like the previous one. Okay. First table is worker. And whatever there will be. That is worker should be worker ID should be there. And I specially not specifically mentioned it will be 
integer or float just simply mention numeric okay length you can increase the length or decrease anything i just for the provisional i given the length 5 and worker id act as an primary key so this is the here and then there will be a underscore name first name okay and obviously that will be worker variable character and length just primary length provided 15 and comma there will be last name also and it also worker Sorry, length will be 15 then there will be salary one column and it will also numeric not specifically integer or float and the length will be 10 then there will be like join date or joining date whatever you write it's upon you join date and obviously it will act as an time stamp time stamp then there will be department obviously it will be in the variable character worker length let's 10 for the provisional and i think okay okay so just put it in and some column so this is the first table that we already have created in this way create table worker worker is the first table name everyone please do it if done then please notify me unmute yourself then we will discuss about bonus table and title table two tables are there in Dancing. between done okay in between in the chat box i am sending uh this the tuple means what data you have to inside or Im implement or insertion tuple insertion you have to do see just checking yes please download from the chat box what tuple you have to insert for these three tables and uh, make it very carefully uh, worker table then the, the bonus table and then title table safely do one thing download all the things safely or gayatri or anyone download all the tuples or the data's send uh, circulate in the three groups in whatsapp and also in the pumble okay sir I think Mehul, Boma, Gayatri, done. Yes, sir. Okay. I'm making the table, sir. Okay, okay. Okay, in between the short type, I'm just in the second one. The next table will be okay. same as separate color yes. separate color let's blue create table and this table will be bonus okay so here worker reference id no gap this is the underscore okay and obviously worker reference id will be numeric not specifically integer or float length uh, primary length i mentioned here five and it actually constraint okay because it will connected from the table constraint and there will be worker bonus bonus 
reference what reference it will reference to worker table sundebesi worker table okay and for worker table which column actually it reference it actually reference worker id okay now there will be bonus date and obviously it will act as for timestamp then bonus amount this will be in the capital okay right in your own way the modification uh, capital or small if you don't way okay. i just create the table for your help and but third assignment i'm not telling you uh, to create the table constant and anything that will be i mentioned but you have to create by your own for the third assignment so this is the table for bonus create table bonus worker reference id and obviously it will be numeric and it will actually act as a constant okay to worker bonus and reference to worker table which column worker id okay then bonus date okay bonus date will be act as a time stamp then bonus amount act as a numeric then the length is 5 so this is the two table please create both of table then i will make for the third one Done, everyone. Making the second table, sir. Okay, okay.
Okay, so uh, Mehul, I checked your message in the chat box. Uh, you can do it that way uh, because already we use simply constant, not mentioning foreign key or anything. You can do it that way. Uh, otherwise, you can do one more thing. Separately, you can create uh, the table that I already mentioned, like create bonus. Okay. If any problem, uh, you can check whether it will be run with uh, the exact foreign key you have been mentioned there or not. But I think it will be worked, not no any facing no any issue. Okay. Okay. It will be work. Thank, Thank you, sir. Thank you. Just two minutes, guys. I will showcase the next one table. Okay, now for the third one. The third one is Notice actually numeric, not specifically mentioned it, lane 5 for the prior and okay sorry this will be act as a constant. Then worker bonus. Reference to work cut table. Column name worker ID, same as before. Same work cut title. And it will be worker in lane 10 
and affected from that will be like time affected from the and it will be time step So simply this is the table okay create it or note it in your notebook Okay, so I hope everybody already created the three tables. Uh, I'm removing it. Now moving on to the 
tuple portion actually whenever that is in the SQL, any SQL server, just like MySQL, PGSQL or Oracle, whenever you created the table and after that, when you going to insert the value or data that will call the tuple insertion. So I already sent it in the chat box, uh, which tuple or which data we have to uh, mention it. Um, just a second, I am sharing my screen. Let's check. Okay, so this is the, I think my screen is visible. So this is the table. One minute. Okay, sorry guys. So uh, this is the worker table. As you know already, if you created the table or noted down, the first column is worker ID. Second is the F name, the first name. So third one is the last name, L name. Then there will be salary, that will be numeric. Then joining date will be there. And there obviously, um, I think one, two, three, four, five, six, okay. Joining date, that the timestamp and the department. So this is the data that you have to input. You have to insert in your table. What table you have created for the worker table? This is the data for the worker table. This is the data. Now moving on to the next part. Uh, just a second. Stop share. And which is the next? Okay. So this is the next one. So this is the next one table, the bonus table. Okay. In the bonus table, uh, see worker reference ID that I mentioned here, it will already constant for worker bonus. Okay. And it will be reference to worker table, the previous table for the which column worker ID column. So this is the worker reference ID. And here it is one, two, three, one, two mentioned. You can use uh, 001, 002, 003, 1, 001, 002, or 101, 202, 303 as your own choice. Okay. It's up on you. Uh, but uh, it will be better than keep just look like whatever they give for the data. Then the bonus date that I mentioned that will be act as a timestamp and the bonus amount that will be mentioned. So this is the uh, tuple or this is the data that you have to insert for the second table. That is the bonus table. Now moving on to the third one. Uh, third one is just a second. Okay. This is the manager. Yes, title table. Okay. So sharing my screen. Okay. I hope uh, my screen is visible. So this is the uh, title table or the third one. So see, as I mentioned for the third table, worker reference ID, same as the previous one, and this will act as an constant directly connected to worker bonus for the reference. It will be connected to worker table, and the first column will be worker ID. What, what reference or what reference actually it does, which column for the worker table, that is the worker ID. So worker reference ID is the first column name in the table title table. Then there will be worker title. Okay, worker title means the post that they are holdings, manager, executive manager, assistant manager, lead. And then they are affected from uh, which date or which time. It is a timestamp that is mentioned uh, partly. And this is the date. Okay, so you can avoid the timestamp also. Just simply write down the dates, no issue. So this is the data table that you have to be insert for the third table, title table. So uh, now on uh, moving for the queries, which queries we have to be done or which queries we have to be made. Uh, first, uh, today I will uh, give in all of you the 10 query. Okay, 10 query and the remaining 13 query will uh, be... Excuse me, sir. Yes. 
So I am getting error in creating the second table. Why getting error? Which portion you are getting error? Uh, so in constraint area, like uh, where I have written reference, it is like showing uh, this is not valid at this position. One minute. Share your screen. Okay, sir. So this one. Spelling, spelling, C E S. Ah, uh, where sir? References, T E S. Now. No sir. Ref create table bonus worker reference ID numeric five constant anti worker bonus ref. Indices. Just, just, just go down. Just go down. Go down. Indices. Worker. What is your first table name? Worker. Worker, yes, sir. Okay, worker. Uh, worker, ID, sir. Worker. Then worker ID. Bonus date. Time. Step. Okay, one minute. One minute. Okay, sir. Okay, this one bonus date, time stamp, bonus amount, numeric five. Why this is happening? Just a second. Create table bonus worker. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, just if it is wrong, just do one thing. Mm. Worker reference ID bonus. Worker reference ID numeric bonus state time stamp constant worker. Do one thing, change it uh, in change, change, change it in that way. I'm sending in the chat box. Okay, sir. One more thing. Check if it is yes, check if it is running or not. Copy it directly. Yes, sir, it is working. Okay, so then use that that thing, use okay. that that purpose, and if uh, just check third one is also uh, getting some error or not, then I will change it. Okay, sir. Table formation. I think it will be not act. It will for PGSQL there. Act. Okay. Okay, sir. Okay, so now, simply you can uh, share screen. I just uh, use your screen for the queries. Okay, sir. Okay. 
so for the queries the first one um, where is pin one minute sefali you can uh, stop share your screen because i'm not finding the pin yes just a second okay so the first one is write a sql query to print the first three characters of <clears throat> if name from worker table okay second one is write sql query to print the a name from worker table after removing white spaces from right side that will be the trim command trim command will be used i mean just giving you the hints not the exactly code it will be used trim command t r i m trim command write sql query that fetches the unique values of department from worker table and find its length <clears throat> this is the third one Uh, mehul i uh, if if there is bonus table i have to see if bonus table there are two portion is there then it will be work what you have just doing it because i just facing server issues that's why i think it will be wrong or um, it's showing error because first that i saw it will correct previously it will work in my system that's why i think facing any issues for the server problem i don't think so okay let's check later but this is the three query already done thank you everyone please write down in the chat box or unmute yourself we have to give in more okay i'm removing the first one
Number four, write SQL query to print the F name from worker table. replacing A with A small whatever there are small A that will be replaced by capital A Yes, yes, not do. Please don't do it right now because it is the assignment. And next week, whenever we do for the database class, already we are discussing with joining and rest of the functions and also checking this assignment side by side. Not doing it, guys. Please just note it, the queries. The number five, write SQL query to print the if name and l names from worker table into a Single column. The column name will be new column name will be full name. Okay. And a special character and a special character should separate them okay so this is the fifth one Number six, <clears throat> write a SQL query to print all worker details from the worker table order by a name which order ascending okay this is the sixth query <clears throat> number seven right sql query to in all worker details from order table sorry worker table worker table
order by if name the previous one if name ascending and department descending both together Number eight, write SQL query to print details of workers with department. name as admin <clears throat> ninth one write a SQL query to fetch the number of workers for each department in the descending order. Okay, and the tenth one write a SQL query to show only odd rows. from from the worker table you have to showcase the odd rows okay so this is the number 10th so today i am giving all of you 10th query that you have to be create or start creation for the SQL man SQL assignment to already create table. I described, I showcase you or given the information how to create the table or which table creation, what type of things will be there. And next day, uh, whenever next day will be project discussion. And in the project discussion uh, for the ongoing project, First of all, ELP data analyst, I would like to see at least 50 to 70% progress on ELP data analyst project next day. Okay. Number two, at least showcase me 10 to 15% work on Instagram reach analysis on which query I have been given. I given rightly 10 to 10 to 12 things type of things before the analyzing anal data analyzing portion and data import data cleaning all of the queries I have given so at least 10 to 15 percent work progress for in Instagram reach analysis project for ELP data analysis project I need to be um, uh, taking the update at least 50 to 70 percent and then we will discuss this assignment later okay so this will be your work you have to do and uh, for the new people for the project purpose see 
uh, already uh, one project data analysis project is covered for covid data analysis i think if you join i actually you are uh, recent joining so it will not be impossible for you to cover up it uh, but uh, the project will be going on and elp data analysis is a short type project and for the data analysis pythons and all the things is there so you please contact with uh, gayatri sefali your coordinators technical coordinators those you can help you you can contact with her in yeah. the pumble and those people yeah. already uh, know about the projects yeah. and the assignment please go through it and start okay and today i think there will be night town hall from 8 to 10 i think i don't know uh, about that exact timing if there is uh, anything from our team at least two people join them and showcase the progress whether you can see the progress about the sql and will be there so my classes will be going on for my own uh, private classes there so that's why i try to join but okay it will be the worker id reference and worker title is not work for me so is it all right yes yes you can do it also mehul so uh, this is the actual work you have to do now i am stop sharing my screen and already recorded all the last lectures video published in the youtube you can check there and sefali gayatri uh, whenever there will be data analyst yeah. uh, in the project meet or town hall meet please showcase at least uh, you or anyone please join there for showcasing at least try to showcase sql assignment also and the project also what you have done so that's my point okay, okay sir okay. <coughs> uh, sir you. yes uh, like 